Hello, how are you? I'm doing fine. Today I will try to make some poses for you, but I will not show how to save them. I will show how to make them with a person which you use and only for renderings, not for a game. So don't know if you understood me, but I will try to show you everything. So mostly I will sh only show. I will talk rare because of my English and sometimes it's difficult to explain so better be if i will write and i always open this one version of blender because the newest version has problems with sim textures i tried to fix that but it's not my problem blender should be fixed and at first i will always open the scene which i will use after that i will go to file, press import and search as uh, which I ripped from the program and press OK. Um, yeah, sorry if some of uh, this will be only photos because my camera doesn't work unless it's a game and I will download another filming pro program but later. So at first I want to show you how to rip your sim. So I'm opening sim ripper uh, then press select uh, go where's your save files and press that save file where's your sim. Um, uh, mostly I look at the date because uh, like if, if I create it right now and I saved him I will see that it's uh, the date is today so yeah it's easiest way to find that save file which you need and yeah then when I say choose the save file I'm pressing OK and then in the left corner you need to choose that sim and wait for a few seconds or sometimes it can take a few minutes depends how much CC that sim wears mine mostly takes one minute uh, OK and in the right corner you can see that I choose all separate meshes and one texture it's the best one for me because of some renderings like um, sadly I don't have a photo and I can show you why I choose this one but maybe one day you will realize why so yeah texture size is hash cube but you can choose standard it's okay and and after that I press DAA and save your sim somewhere where you will find him easily. Okay, when I'm coming going back to the blender, I open the scene. Uh, I will use Photo Studio. Um, I'm pressing camera and change settings if you want. I will render in cycles. If your computer is not strong, do in Eve or change cycle settings like I did. I always change samples because I don't need that super duper good quality because Instagram still will break all quality. So you can change your photo format too if you want. I always do like this. So okay, now it's time to open your sim in Blender. Press file, then import and press collada. Look for your sim, press OK. Uh, now you see that he is not good looking, right? But don't worry, we will fix it. I always make two screens, yeah, so just press like I show you and drag. Now we will fix the sim. Press where I'm showing, choose bottom, and in the left corner choose from 3D viewport to shader editor. And we see some stuff, we will fix that with that. Yeah. Uh, specular to specular, that's important. Then press Shift plus A. If you are using Windows or press Add, then Shader and Mix Shader. And, and put beneath Material Output and Principal BSDF. Then drag BSDF to the shader, not where it is in the middle. 
Now where is the base color? You need to drag alpha to PAC. Okay, and then press add again and again shader and transparent. Uh, put someone near, then drag BSDF to the shader which is in the middle. And after that, press material properties, viewport display, and change blend mode to alpha hash head. And you need to change all of your textures, but don't worry, you can make it easier. Works only if you are using all separated meshes and one texture. Okay, then press all of them, then press Ctrl L and link materials. That's it. Everything looks amazing, right? Oh, now it's time for poses. Uh, press object mode and change to pose mode. Press where I'm showing and press show known x-ray. You can see it there. When you're pressing A you see a lot of dots. Now you will easily make poses. And poses tutorial will be next time so just watch right now I will make it fast <laughs> and simple post <laughs>